Alright, hey guys, I'm just sitting in front of my computer uh, trying to record this for about 10 times now. Um, I'm finally just gonna attempt to do it again and hopefully this time I can get out what I want to say. Okay, um, so recently I've been really mad and upset at a lot of things and I'm not gonna go into too deep with all that. But I just wanted to say that and I know that a lot of people make videos like these um, and I know I might not be able to make a big difference because I'm a, such a small youtuber but if I can make a life uh, the, if I can make a change in someone's life and if I can make a change for the better I'm gonna try to do it because obviously I don't want anyone feeling upset so recently I was talking to my friend and um, I found out something really hurtful about him and it almost broke my heart when he told me and so I talked to him for a little bit and we kind of talked about it and all of that and I found out that he was harming himself and I'm not going to go again into too deep with that because I don't really want to I don't want to have to explain all of this stuff about um, my friends or really anything I don't want to explain too deep in detail but he has been bullied for most of his life and I know a lot of people who have been. Even I used to be bullied when I was younger. Not badly because I'm the type of person who will just stick up. And that's a big part of my personality. I will not just sit there and let you do the stuff to me. There will be one day when you'll randomly get back what you deserved. And um, it, I don't know if it helps me or if it doesn't. But... I, I, that's why I don't really think I was bullied that much is just because the person who used to bully me um, I wouldn't take it from her I would just go and <laughs> I don't even want to explain half of the stories so I'm not gonna but um, I I just got heartbroken when he told me that that people were bullying him and all of and I know this happens with a lot of people. It's not the worst story I've heard. But it sounded like I was thinking. I'm like, why would someone do this? Like, they don't even know who he is. But yet they're going and they're throwing stuff at him. They're calling him a loser. And all this stuff. And I'm just sitting here like, why? Why would you deliberately want to target someone for no reason? Not even knowing who they are and knowing what they're going through. I know this guy is going through depression for... I don't even know how long and I try to talk about his suicide so many times I have stayed up till 2 in the morning talking to him just to try to keep him with me like I really care for this guy and here's all these guys going and being complete like jerks to him and I don't know why like why would someone want to hurt someone of their own kind like don't people realize that like it just is so hurtful to see all of these things happening through the internet, through like physical, just all of these things that's going on in our world, and no one cares. I mean, of course there's people who care, but when someone says they're going through depression or they're having suicidal thoughts, you don't care half the time unless you really know them, and. It just breaks my heart to see that, to see people going through all these hurtful things, having so much bad stuff happen to them, and no one cares. I know that uh, there's a time in my life, I suffered depression for a few weeks, and I didn't think anyone cared for me anymore. And there was one day I was sitting in my bed, and... I literally was just standing at the ceiling and I was so upset. I cried that night for about four hours. That's almost like three quarters of a school day. I cried. Just stood there and cried at about all of these things because I thought I was alone. My best friends weren't talking to me. All of this stuff is going on and I don't think they meant it. Um, I, like, I don't think they deliberately meant for me to feel like that. 
I don't think they deliberately meant to ignore me. They were busy, but at that moment, I just felt so alone. And it just, to think that people could be going through that, it's just so hurtful. Like, I can't even explain what it feels like to go through all of this stuff. It's hard to explain. You don't know how to say the words. You can't just say, oh, I'm upset right now. Like, you just don't say that. You say, oh, I'm fine, or of this. Or you don't want anyone near you. Like, you just want to, sh like, shut everything out. Half the time, you don't even want to be there anymore. And that's where things get hard. When you start having thoughts like that, it's so hurtful. And... Um, uh, I've known people who have taken their lives from those thoughts. And so back to my original point. If you know someone who gets bullied, or if you are a bully yourself, think of what you're doing. Think of everything you say to everyone. That one thing that you might say to that girl, even behind her back, if you say she's crazy or she's ugly, no, I wouldn't date her. You don't know what she's going through. You don't know if the next day she'll hang herself. And you'll have to live with that for the rest of your life. So. Okay, sorry, my mom came in. Okay. So back to my original point. You don't know what she's going through. You don't know if she has a giant crush on you. You don't know that. But you don't, like, you just don't know. So I, I just like to think, to ask one thing of everyone. Think of what you're doing. Because... I know almost all of you will go through some stage in your life where you'll feel like the lowest person on the world. That you yourself will feel like there's no way of escaping it. It will surround you and consume you. And you will forever be in pain. And no one wants to feel like that. So, please just be aware of what you're saying to people about what you're doing. About everything. Just be aware of your surroundings. And that's really all I can ask for. And before I say anything else, I, I just want to end with a point. Don't judge people. And I know that's also a little bit off of this, but just don't. I've had some of my friends come up to me terrified to tell me stuff. And then they just tell me that they're bi. If you don't know what bi is, it means that you like both genders. But... I'm just so sh like shocked that people would be terrified to tell someone that. Like, it's so sad how much our society is against different cultures, different races, like different sexualities. It's just so sad that people will judge someone upon that, will hold it against them. So, I leave. Pretty much, that's all I want to say. It, I don't know what else to add, but hopefully you guys listen through, and hopefully you guys come out with a new perspective. But if you don't, if you, this is just another meaningless video to you, I understand, but please don't let anyone else feel what I've had to feel. Goodbye.